Hello, everyone. With the launch of Diablo 4's Season 5, Season of the Infernal Hordes, it's the perfect time to explore new classes and experience the game from a fresh perspective. As each new season resets your character, you'll need to build them up from scratch, providing an excellent opportunity to try out a class you might not have played before. While every class in Diablo 4 is viable, some tend to stand out more than others due to their strength and versatility, especially with Blizzard's regular balance updates that can shift the meta from season to season. In Season 5, the class you choose can significantly impact your gameplay experience, so it's worth considering which one aligns best with your playstyle. Whether you're diving into the action with a powerful barbarian or strategically planning your moves with a cunning sorcerer, our ranked list of classes for the Season of the Infernal Hordes will help you make an informed decision on your next character build. I'm quickly moving on to the video, and I'm ranking classes in Diablo 4 Season 5. Before we start, if you enjoy these types of tier list videos, don't forget to like the video and subscribe. Enjoy watching. My friends, only 0.1% of viewers subscribe. If you like this type of content, please do not forget to subscribe to the channel. Thank you in advance for your support. The classes in this tier are, in order from top left to bottom right, Druid and Necromancer. The Druid class in Diablo 4's Season 5 offers a unique yet challenging gameplay experience, especially early on. It takes time and effort to fully optimize their build, making the early grind feel slow Druids excel in versatility, but their true potential is unlocked only after obtaining specific gear that enhances their abilities. This class is best suited for players willing to invest time in carefully crafting their build. Once properly equipped, Druids can unleash devastating damage on even the most formidable Infernal Hordes. They are notably tanky, with exceptional raw DPS potential. Additionally, Druids possess a variety of crowd control tools, including abilities that inflict vulnerable and immobilize, making them a powerful force in battle once fully developed. The Necromancer, like the Druid, faces significant challenges in the initial stages of Infernal Horde runs in Diablo 4 Season 5. Without a well-optimized build, Necromancers struggle to deliver the burst damage necessary to cut through the relentless waves of enemies. Given their fragility, they can quickly become overwhelmed if the hordes manage to swarm them before they can unleash their attacks. This makes the early game particularly difficult for Necromancers, requiring players to carefully manage their positioning and focus on clearing out the Hellbreach dungeons to establish a solid build. As the game progresses, Necromancers must continue to grind through more challenging content to obtain the new uniques and legendary aspects, which are essential for maximizing their damage potential. This class relies more heavily on high DPS numbers than any other in Diablo 4, making it crucial to invest time in refining your build. While Necromancers may face an uphill battle in the beginning, with the right strategy and persistence, they can evolve into a formidable force capable of decimating their foes. The classes in this tier are, in order from top left to bottom right, Barbarian. Barbarians have consistently been a solid choice in Diablo 4, especially in Season 5, due to their balanced gameplay and accessibility. Known for their straightforward playstyle, Barbarians are ideal for players who prefer not to overcomplicate their builds during the early stages of Infernal Hordes. Their defensive capabilities, combined with powerful AoE damage, make them a versatile class that can handle most challenges with ease. Whether you're new to the game or a seasoned veteran, the Barbarian offers a reliable and effective option for tackling the game's toughest content. One of the standout features of Barbarians is their simplicity in building and optimizing, which allows players to focus more on the action rather than the intricacies of gear and skills. Despite their ease of use, they are far from basic, offering a range of defensive tools 
and DPS skills that can melt through enemies. With the right setup, Barbarians can dominate the battlefield, making them a top-tier choice for players looking to progress smoothly through Diablo IV's Infernal Hordes. The classes in this tier are, in order from top left to bottom right, Rogue and Sorcerer. In Season of the Infernal Hordes, Rogues are undeniably a top-tier choice for players looking to dominate Diablo IV. With the introduction of powerful uniques like the Umbra Crux, Dagger, and Shroud of Condurus, rogues have become a force to be reckoned with. Their exceptional DPS capabilities allow them to swiftly dismantle even the toughest content, while their crowd control abilities add an extra layer of versatility. This potent combination makes them a standout class for both early and late game challenges. Despite their fragility, which is comparable to necromancers, rogues compensate with unparalleled mobility. Their agility and movement skills enable them to kite enemies effectively, making them highly effective against the infernal hordes from the very beginning. This agility helps them overcome their lack of defensive options, ensuring they remain a formidable presence in any battle. In Diablo 4 Season 5, the Sorcerer stands out as the premier class for its unparalleled versatility and sheer power. With an arsenal of damage and crowd control abilities, Sorcerers excel in managing both single target and large scale engagements, making them ideal for tackling the infernal hordes. Their robust AoE capabilities ensure they can efficiently clear waves of enemies, proving invaluable in the wave-based game mode introduced this season. Sorcerers are not only a top choice for any party setup, but also shine individually, thanks to their ability to adapt to various builds. Their effectiveness is further amplified by unique items such as the Axial Conduit and the Vox Omnium Staff, which significantly boost their DPS. As the best overall class for the season of the Infernal Hordes, the Sorcerer promises a powerful and dynamic gameplay experience. The video ends here. See you in another video. Don't forget to subscribe.